Next topic is color of lanthanoids. The lanthanoids metal ions or the lanthanoid metal complex, which are having at least one unpaired electron in their 4f orbitals, show FF transition, and due to this FF transition, the lanthanoid metal ions or lanthanoid metal complex gives us the color. Some lanthanoid metal ion, like as lanthanum plus 3, cerium plus 4, ytterbium plus 2, and deuterium plus 3, are colorless because in case of the lanthanum plus 3 and cerium plus 4, there is no electron present in the F subshells because the F0 electronic configuration after removal of 3 and 4 electrons. In ytterbium plus 2 and deuterium plus 3, the 14 electrons present in the F orbitals, so unpaired electron is absent. That's why they do not show the DD transitions, oh sorry, FF transition. That's why these are colorless. The electronic configuration of lanthanum is 4F0, 5D1 and 6S2. After the removal of 3 electron, that is 2 from S and 1 from D, it becomes lanthanum plus 3. So in case of lanthanum plus 3, the F0 electronic configuration it will attain, so no unpaired electron. In case of cerium plus 2, after the removal of the 4 electron, the electronic configuration will become F0, so F orbital is empty. Similarly, in case of ytterbium, if we remove the 2 electrons, it will become ytterbium plus 2 and it will acquire the F14 electronic configuration. So all the orbitals are fully filled, no unpaired electron is present. In case of the lutetium, if we remove the 3 electrons, it will become lutetium plus 3 and 4 F14 electronic configuration. So no unpaired electron is present in case of lutetium plus 3. As we know that the cerium plus 2, cerium plus 4 having F0 electronic configuration. So no electron is present in F orbital. So cerium plus 4 should be colorless or I can say cerium dioxide should be colorless because in cerium dioxide the electronic configuration of cerium is plus 4 but cerium dioxide or cerium plus 4 is an intense red color substance. So why this is? This is because due to the metal ligand charge transfer. So we know that in cerium plus 2 the F subshell is completely empty and oxygen is attached with the cerium plus 2 and we know that O2 negative the electronic configuration is 1s2. 2s2 and 2p6. Here the oxygen attached to the cerium is act as a ligand. So all the cells of the or all the orbitals of the ligand oxide O2 negative are filled with the electrons. So ligand is filled with the electron and metal is empty. 4f subshells of the metal is empty. So the ligand transfer its electron density to the metals. So here due to this ligand to metal charge transfer this complex is intense in red or intense red color next exception is that cerium plus 3 and ytterbium plus 3 have unpaired electron in their f orbitals yet they are colorless so in case of the cerium plus 2 there is one electron is present in the 4f orbitals that is here and in case of the ytterbium plus 3 the 13 electron present in the 4f subshell or 4f orbitals that is 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10, 11, 12 and 13. So one unpaired electron is present for the uh, in case of ytterbium plus 3 and one unpaired electron is present for cerium plus 3. They can show easily DD transition but they are colorless. When a metal complex is formed, the seven degenerated orbitals splits into three sets that is T1G, T2G and A2G. In case of cerium plus 3 that is one electron is present which will occupy the T1G orbitals. And when light falls on this metal complex, this orbital, this electron present in the T, T1G orbitals goes to the higher energy orbitals that is either from T1G to T2G or from T1G to A2G. So this is, this is, these are the F orbitals, these are also F orbitals and A2G is also F orbitals. So from lower F orbitals, electron goes to the higher F orbitals. So this is called as FF transition. In case of the cerium plus 4 and ytterbium plus 3, FF transition occurs but not in the visible region, it occurs in the ultraviolet regions. So, as we know that the, we are not able to see the ultraviolet uh, those transitions which are occurs in the ultraviolet regions. In ytterbium, there is 14 electrons that is 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13. So, the one unpaired electron is present here. So, electron from lower uh, energy orbitals goes to the higher energy orbitals when the ultraviolet light fall on this complex. So, because the transitions are FF transitions takes place in the ultraviolet regions. That's why cerium plus 3 and ytterbium plus 3 do not give us color, although the FF transitions takes place. Next question is that gadolinium, which is having F7 electronic configurations, also having the unpaired electron in 4F subshells or 4F orbitals, but it is also the colorless. Why it is colorless? In case of gadolinium, there are 7 electrons that is 1, 2, 3, 4, 
five, six, and seven. So this one is T one G, or I can say F orbitals. These are the T two G F orbitals, and this is the A two G F orbitals. So all those orbitals in which the number of electrons before and after the transitions are different are called as spin forward and transition. Suppose this is a condition of the before transition. This is a condition of before transition. So number of unpaired electron before transition is seven. After transition, suppose to be any one of the electron from t one g or t two g orbitals goes to the higher energy orbitals. Suppose one electron from t two g orbitals goes to the a two g orbitals. So this electron will paired here. And the number of electron after transition will become one, two, three, four, and five. So number of electron before and after the transition is different. Such kind of the transition are called as spin forbidden transition. Spin forbidden transitions. And the another thing is that the electronic transitions occurs in the same orbitals. The lower energy orbitals also have, and the higher energy orbitals are also have orbitals. So in this case, yeah, in in the case in that case where the Electronic transitions takes place place in the same orbitals are called as Laporte forbidden transitions. So due to the spin forbidden and Laporte forbidden transition, gadolinium plus three is the colorless. Due to the spin forbidden and Laporte forbidden transition, gadolinium plus three is the colorless.